Hi, I'm Dan Limbach, producer of the Pharma Voice Webcast Network at the Scope Summit in Orlando, Florida. In this Editor's Take video, I meet with Nagaraja Srivatsan, Senior Vice President and Chief Digital Officer, Research and Development Solutions at IQVIA. Srivatsan, thank you for taking some time out to speak with us at the Scope Conference in Orlando. Thank you. As the Chief Digital Officer at, at IQVIA, can you share more about the rise of the role and its impact on an organization? Great. As a Chief Digital Officer, uh, we're trying to do two things in the marketplace. One is to bring digitization to what we do within every aspect of our business. And the second is to actually launch digital products which then can be consumed by people in the market. As a Chief Digital Officer, digitization is fundamental to it. And digitization is not alone bringing things in a digital format, but using data, AI, analytics, and all the combinations of technology to make an impact. Outstanding. Let's talk about your clinical stack. Why is IQVIA focused on building its clinical stack, and what unique capabilities does your organization bring to the table? At IQVIA, we have a strong and rich heritage around supporting patient needs and the clinical trial infrastructure. We've acquired several different clinical technologies. What we're doing is combining these technologies around four suites of products. The first, to help transform the patient and patient engagement. Second, to transform sites and how the sites get transformed. Third, really looking at it from a sponsor's perspective and transforming the clinical trial process. And last but not the least, a data suite which integrates uh, all of these different suites together in a harmonized and homogenized manner. Very good. So let's look a little bit into the future. What does the next generation clinical stack look like? The next generation clinical stack is one which makes the three key stakeholders in a clinical trial process work in a harmonized and homogenized manner. It's the patient who's in the center of that to how do you engage them better, to the sites to make sure that they can enroll and take care of the patients, and the sponsors who can then bring all of the information and data together to build next generation therapeutics. The key problem today is that each of the clinical stacks today are built from individual perspective rather than resolving the friction between the different stakeholders. Underpinning all of this is a strong data suite which integrates, homogenizes, and harmonizes information that enables smooth interaction between the stakeholders. As we start to really look at next generation clinical technologies, we need to really think about not just about what the systems are doing, but what can they help in terms of prediction, prescription, as well as building the next generation algorithms which make the friction go away. We think by building a next generation data platform which can help you build these algorithms at scale, which can then not alone enable the next best action, but also help in complying to regulatory rigors like GDPR, like uh, things around uh, ethics and bias, we think that that would be the foundation for a robust and uh, successful clinical technology platform. That's very interesting. So let's shift the focus to the patient. How does the next generation clinical stack deliver digital innovation while enhancing patient care? The whole clinical trial process is about the patient. Today there's a lot of uh, challenges in first identifying the right patient, enrolling them, engaging them, and taking care of them through the clinical trial process. The next generation of clinical stack is to make that patient engagement journey as seamless and smooth as possible, to engage the patient wherever they are, at their homes or at sites, being able to collect information and data from them in both a digital format as well as in a format where they can come in uh, to the site to really look at data and lab data and other infrastructure to be integrated so that we can make the process in a seamless manner. Our patient at the center, data which the patient uh, uh, is providing as, uh, around them, and then the clinical trial process using that to engage and make that process much better. 
Well, the future looks pretty bright. Srivatsan, thanks for spending some time with us at the Sculpt Conference. Thank you. Thank you for watching this Editor's Take video. For more information about IQVIA, visit IQVIA.com. And don't forget to check out our other Editor's Take videos at PharmaVoice.com slash videos.